Urban Nature is about how the city uh, can bring together such different economic survival methods, strategies, how can uh, individualism cohabit the city together with the utopias of a bigger society. That nature that happens in the urban space cannot happen on a village. It cannot happen in a small city, so there's something extra. It is something different that you cannot really control, and so it apparently starts to get its own rhythms and um, specificities. The goal is um, to make the network of urban dependencies uh, visible and, and possible to experience in a, in a closed museum space. It is immersive, it is um, yeah, embracing you somehow and really inviting you to go and, and for a moment slip into the shoes of somebody else. People whom you might not get close to in your everyday life. What we try is to bring uh, people into certain situations that they can experience uh, uh, together as a group or in a, in a single track. Everybody in this space will become kind of an actor or a representative for the others in the room. So if we crack it open, then you have suddenly two situations. There's a reflection on the reflection going on, and it's doing and observing. It's existing and coexisting, which is much more urban, which is much more what the city is about. There's whatever you do in the city, there's always somebody who can see it from a different angle. Things that could be dealt with in statistics or in a journalistic research that tries to be objective, you kind of go subjectively from one role to another. Yeah, it's really a question of if you can still say it's an audience because everybody needs to really be active, like you can't just sit there and watch. I think that's the whole magic about it, that afterwards you have the feeling I spoke with somebody, although you didn't say one word. <laughs>